my dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus. Today, it is the Palm Sunday, and we read from the Gospel of Luke chapter 22, verses 14 to 23 and 56. We read as follows, Jesus went to the Mount of Olives, and the disciples followed him. And when he came to the place, he said to them, Pray that you may not enter into temptation. And he withdrew from them about one stone's throw, and knelt down and prayed, Father, if thou art willing, remove this cup from me. Nevertheless, not my will, but thine will be done. Then the angel from the heaven appeared to him and gave him strength. In his anguish he prayed more earnestly, and his sweat became like great drops of blood falling down on the ground. And when he rose from prayer, he came to the disciples and found them sleeping for sorrow. And he said to them, Why do you sleep? Rise and pray that you may not enter into temptation. While he was still speaking, there came a crowd, and the man called Judas, one of the twelve, was leading them. He drew near to Jesus to kiss him, but Jesus said to him, Judas, would you betray the Son of Man with a kiss? My dear brothers and sisters, today we read the whole account of the Passion of our Lord as an introduction to Holy Week. We see our Lord in agony in Gethsemane. He is God. He could see in great detail what was coming. He could see the blows and shoves of the shoulders. He could feel the shackles and chains clamping his sacred limbs. He could count the whippings one after another. He could remember the thorns in his crown and the blows of the reed on his sacred head. He could hear the mockery and insults and all the blasphemies that would come out of those shouting mouths. He could perceive the weight of the cross on his shoulders, staring his already wounded skin. He could feel the nails piercing his hands and feet, and spear breaking his sacred heart. These left scars on his body, but there was also wounds in his soul, desertion, rejection, abandonment, betrayal of those he loved. They fell asleep with indifference, ran away in fear, hid out of cowardice, and one of them sold him out of greed. The priest once had a dream. He met an angel who comforted our Lord during his agony. Out of curiosity, he asked the angel, What did you say to Jesus to console him that night? The angel replied, I talked to him about you. Dear Lord, I love you. I don't want to fall asleep. I don't want to run away. I want to comfort you, saying close to your ma mother during this holy week. We love you so much. We don't want to fall asleep. We don't want to run away. We don't want to sell you. May we want to comfort you. May we say closer to our Lord Jesus during this holy week. Let us stay closer to Jesus like our mother Mary during the crucifixion. Let us stay closer to Jesus during this Holy Week. May our actions glorify God. Amen.